Hello, and welcome back to Amazing World, a glimpse into our bright future. I'm Luna, your guide on this journey through the frontiers of science and innovation. Today, we explore a future where our oceans may finally breathe free again, liberated from the mountains of plastic choking their waters. And the heroes of this story? Not great machines or massive cleanup efforts, but tiny, invisible life forms. Bacteria with a remarkable appetite for plastic. To understand how this is possible, let's start at the molecular level. Plastics like PET, polyethylene, terephthalate, are made of long, tightly bound chains of carbon and hydrogen, forming strong polymer structures. These chains don't naturally break down in the environment because they're incredibly stable and resistant to heat, moisture, and microbial attack. That's why plastic bottles can persist for centuries in our oceans. But then came a discovery that changed everything. In 2016, scientists in Japan isolated a bacterium called Edionella sakaiensis. This tiny organism produces a special enzyme known as Ptase. Think of this enzyme as a pair of microscopic molecular scissors designed to cut apart the tough polymer chains of PET. Once the chains are snipped into smaller pieces, called monomers, the bacterium absorbs them, converting plastic waste into energy and harmless byproducts like water and carbon dioxide. However, in nature, this process happens at a snail's pace. A single bacterium working on its own takes weeks or even months to break down small amounts of plastic. To solve this, scientists turn to protein engineering. At the University of Manchester, researchers analyzed the enzyme's molecular structure and engineered an improved version. By refining the enzyme's active site, the precise area where it interacts with plastic, they created a version that operates faster and more efficiently, even at higher temperatures. This bioengineered enzyme can now break down plastics up to six times faster than its natural counterpart. Imagine vast bioreactors, where tons of plastic waste are processed daily, broken down into harmless raw materials. Instead of centuries, the degradation now takes just days. It's a vision of large-scale industrial bio-recycling that could change how we handle plastic waste forever. And for the oceans themselves, the plan is even more direct. Engineers envision fleets of autonomous drones and floating platforms that not only collect plastic waste, but also release stabilized enzyme capsules directly into polluted waters. These capsules dissolve microplastics before they can sink or enter the food chain. Even with this technology, one thing remains clear. Prevention is still our greatest tool. Inducing plastic production and finding sustainable alternatives are essential. But with these microscopic allies, we now have a way to heal the damage already done. And that changes everything. A path to clean oceans won't be easy, but every scientific breakthrough brings us closer to a world where the shores are once again clean and the oceans thrive with life.